Hello dear students. Welcome back to yet another class of subject computers. Today we are going to learn about storage devices under chapter number 8. Children, you have already studied about input devices and output devices in your previous chapters. And in this chapter we are going to study about different type of storage devices. Now, what is storage? You know, it is one of the most important benefits which is provided by a computer that you can store your work for future use. Once you store your work, it will be available for you for your future reference any time later. Now, what are storage devices? A computer can store your work in different storage devices. Some of those are hard disk, CD, pen drive. Now, let's have a look at these devices one by one. First of all, hard disk. Hard disk is the main storage device that is fixed inside your CPU. Now hard disk is used to store large amount of data and information and it is also known as hard drive. You can store a very huge amount of data in it and it is also very fast in speed. Next is CD-ROM disk. A CD-ROM is circular shaped disk that is used to store data. The full form of CD-ROM is compact disk read only memory. A CD-ROM is also called a portable disk with the help of which you can transfer data from one computer to another. Now let us learn about DVD. A DVD stands for digital video disk. It is similar in shape to that of a CD-ROM but has a larger storage capacity as compared to CD-ROM. The next one is pen drive. Pen drive is the most popularly used devices to store your work. It is a small and portable device with the help of which you can transfer data safely from one computer to another. It is also called flash drive. Children, one more thing here. If you want to use CD or DVD in your computer, that means if you want to store and read data from a CD-ROM or DVD, the CD-ROM DVD is inserted into a drive which is attached to your CPU. So that means your computer should have one. That was it about the chapter. Thank you and happy learning.